So I've always been a big fan of watching other creators and how they make their videos, the setups they use, how they set it up, what equipment they use exactly, in hopes that it will give me the inspiration to create my own all-in-one setup. And today is the day, well, the week. I've created this all-in-one setup recently and it is working flawlessly. It's really quick to set up, it's really quick to tear down, and you can make it so modular, you can put everything all in one little area. It's so really well done and compact. You are absolutely gonna love it. Also, you can control it with your phone. So I've got my phone, I've got the Ciders Link app over here, and I can just click a button and turn it all off. Click a button, turn it on, change colors, change the levels of light whilst I'm sitting here and monitoring it on the tiniest little monitor on the camera. So starting off with the setup, we have the Aperture Amaran 200X, which acts as our key light. Attached to that, we have the Godox 65D Lantern Diffuser. This diffuser diffuses the hard one source light that comes out of the Amaran 200X, allowing the highlights and the shadows within the image to be extremely smooth and polished. Moving on to the sound for the microphone, we're using the Sennheiser MKE 600 microphone, and it's all housed on this little arm attached to the C stand that the lights also attached to and then the cable leads us over to the audio recorder which is the audio devices mix pre 6 2 and all of this is being housed on a C stand with a few knuckles and a retention arm and finally moving over to the camera the camera is separate from this whole setup mainly because it is easier to have the camera separate from your audio and lighting. Audio and lighting can be together, but camera, you kind of want to move it around for different purposes and you don't want it to be tied to a complex setup. And not forgetting about the ambient lighting, I typically use LED strips, but not all my furniture has LED strips attached to it. So I just improvise with an Aperture MC set to an RGB mode in blue. So if you guys enjoyed this video, if you did, please make sure to leave a like. If you really, really loved it, then make sure to subscribe. I'm gonna be leaving all the equipment and all the gear as a link's in the description below. So I hope you guys go and pick yourself up some of it, maybe build your own rig, and if you do, please let me know and show me. But it's time really bad. I'm going to end this video here. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thank you so, so much for watching. Take care, everybody, and bye-bye.